Hello, my name is Ian Usher, I'm the Product Manager for Modern Governor and in this brief video I'm going to give you a demonstration on how to access the Governor Live events that we were running with the NGA and with Adobe, uh, the first one of which is on the 22nd of June. And we're going to show you how to do that using the Adobe Connect mobile app, which is a free download for iOS or Android, works on tablets, that's iPads, and smartphones, that's an iPhone, or any other Android phone or tablet. Once you've installed the app on your device, you just need to tap it once. It's that green and grey icon that's there in the middle of this screen. So once you tap this, it will switch to landscape mode. And then it will ask you for what it calls the meeting URL. This is the address of Governor Live that you have been sent once you've registered. You do need to register for Governor Live in order to take part. Um, and we'll come on to that in a moment. But what I'm going to do straight away is I'm going to, in the text box, I'm going to tap in modern governor dot adobe connect dot com and then forward slash governor live that's all lowercase modern governor dot adobe connect dot com forward slash governor live you are welcome to do this whenever you want to you don't have to do it on the night so what this will allow you to do is if you want to practice doing this before the event to make sure you can log in successfully the app will then remember your what you've typed in here and it will then retain it and the next time you start the app you won't have to type this in again you'll just be able to pick it from a list that appears just below this box. But this is the first time I've typed this in so I'm just going to make sure it's okay moderngovernor.adobeconnect.com forward slash governor live that all looks good so I'm going to tap the next button it will then connect to the event and then ask me to log in you have to register very simple process and um, takes a couple of minutes um, you just need an email and to choose a password and once you've done that your email becomes your login. So I'm going to put in my email address and then the password that I chose. Once I've done that and I've clicked the done button, I can then click the enter button. And it will connect me to the meeting room, to the event. Now because I'm doing this before the 22nd of June and before about quarter past 20 past 7 on that evening I get a message saying that the event has not yet started and this is absolutely fine you can practice this as many times as you want to beforehand just to reassure yourself and your colleagues if you're working with other governors that you can access the event on the night itself once the event is opened uh, you can sit there with the screen on your device and once the event is open you will see what's going on you'll see the various presentation elements and you'll see the people who are presenting and that will appear on here so you just don't have to do anything from here if you're going in before the day just click cancel and back out and then click cancel login but if I go back here you'll see that when I come to go in the next time it's remembered that address in that black bar is the address that I've used before so even if everything in here was removed I can just click that black bar and it puts the address up there so I don't need to go and type that in again and then it asks me to log in uh, the next time so I'm going to leave that for the moment but that's how to access the meeting that's how to access the event and in the next video we'll be showing you how to interact with the various elements um, that are inside the event the presentations the people speaking the other people who are in the event um, and the different ways in which you'll be able to find your way around the event